the wife of the governorship candidate of Lagos State in the PDP came out. People now know her. Two days ago, she met with market women, and, you know. Yesterday, Do you think she, she met with people with disabilities. Do you think she came out late? Election is few days. That's a question we asked. Don't forget we asked the, yes. the media call. And they said yesterday. they have their own strategy. And, and, and he said, plan, okay, they are playing, playing their joker. That's, that's <laughs> according to, according <laughs> to what the media They are playing their joker. Like, uh, that's what did he say yesterday? It's not me that like, said it. It's their own strategy. So this is the checkmate. The wife. So he said, when, when they feel there is necessity to For respond to, to some out. of the you know, allegations and all, they do. So in this case, they feel it's time for her to come out. And so did you see the She came interview? back from the U.S. and she spoke to the people. Can we have Jando's video and uh, City Wife relating with, um, you know, people with disabilities, market women and all of that. Uh, mm. It was about uh, four days to the end of the campaign when this started. I think it was uh, three days to the end of the campaign. She might probably, she might probably not be in the country. <laughs> she uh, lives in the U.S. She said it's in the public sphere that she lives with the children in the U.S. and she is being fully in support of the I, would, I have so many things to mm -hmm. say, but I will just wait till after election. You know, before you say it. Before I say it. Because if I say it now, it might look as if I'm inciting some people in case or, of people or... Or intentionally the marketing. Yes. Some. So I'll just, <laughs> I'll just <laughs> chill till... After elections. After elections. After elections. Then we'll now have some deep conversation. we we'll really have to understand what politics is in Africa, in Nigeria, get? But I will just post from there. You saw the interview between Daddy Fries and Jando. Yeah. And uh, the the saga that is between the Labour Party candidates and the PDP And candidate. the PDP candidates, so the I P saw that. The Labour well. Party candidates, I mean, gubernatorial candidates yes. in Lagos has been in the PDP for about six years. So this is the video of um, the, the wife, wife yes. of Jando. Meeting with the people with disabilities. I'm still waiting to see her face. She's a pretty yeah. woman. She's a pretty woman. So since the since the um, media aid said they have they have their own strategies and how they work and how things run, how things play, it's fine. We just wait until so this is our coming. Is, yeah, that's the woman. So for <laughs> those of you that think Jando is single or is a bachelor. <laughs> Are you behind him from the corner? Are you behind him from the corner? Hopefully Sorry. You want to disturb his administration. Hopefully, if he becomes the governor. Now, this is the wife. Came from the United States. Like my colleague said. <laughs> <laughs> she said it herself. All right, so she said it herself. Let's quickly listen to her because uh, we still have to go to the governor of Lagos State as well. To meet our SLSC because the D day is coming, which we believe that is the day the Lord made us to celebrate with Him because it's not easy. He has been the only man that caused the fiscal challenge from his heart without no stress. So we are here to meet him, to air out our view. And I so much thank God that majority of our fiscally challenged persons that did not believe, they are here today, they saw him one-on-one. -on -one. We spoke with our Excellency's wife, and she gave us the courage, the hope, which our Excellency has been giving on to us. Represent assurance, except only fool that doesn't know what he wants, or that doesn't know the suffering person living with disability is passing through in Lagos State. That will not vote for him. I'm giving 100% assurance. Can you tell us some of the 